welcome to my channel and if you're new here my name is Kaylee welcome to another week vlog it is a special week because it's their birthdays today is Lindsay's birthday I'm 19. my baby sister she's 19 <laughs> We're on the way to go to the gym. We're gonna hit booty. We're gonna hit glutes today. Goals or whatever. <laughs> She's strong or whatever. Like that booty. That should hurt. She swallow whatever. Look at those legs. <laughs> Period. That was good. Just like guys hate Bulgarian split squats so much. Oh my god. <laughs> We were told we can't vlog, but Lindsay just did 19 reps for her 19th birthday. Guys, I'm so Ready to go home, we're tired. Let's go. Look at her hair, guys. <laughs> Riley got Lindsay a cake. You wanna say hi? And then we got Riley. <laughs> so cute. Max. Baby. I got the sunscreen sent into me, literally. No way. <laughs> it's bright as fuck it's outside. Like cream. Yeah. It works so well too. And I'm so white, like I have no hey, tan. Yeah, no, she's she glows. I, I can't even tell what it's on you. You're so funny, Riley. <laughs> <laughs> Representation of the 19th year. <laughs> So cute. Take a bite. Mordida, mordida. Like, I'm very blessed to have you, I'm guys, in my life. Like, on some real shit, I'm so blessed.
morning guys i woke up feeling such in a good mood i did my millionaire morning routine i'm so excited for today today is gonna be a day full of self-care i am starting the day with getting my hair done love hair day good morning good i'm morning. vlogging if you don't mind i need to do it more but the people i've done it on it's like that's what I want. Like, like uh, brings back moisture to your mm, hair. It'll be healthy and shining. I just imagine like, okay, my millionaire self, like embodying her and like her thoughts, how she thinks, yes, how she feels, girl. how she takes care of herself. And like my millionaire self goes in for hair treatments on a Thursday. Yeah. Like, that's what she does. And she takes care of her health, including her hair. So adorable. My cut is short. Hi loves, oh my goodness, I love the new look. Now you can actually get a good look on it. Oh, it's so short and refreshing and I love it. I am eating my lunch. I did get some pot belly with some mac and cheese. Watch some YouTube, give myself a little bit of time. I hate these eyelashes, like I never wanna wear falsies ever again. I'm gonna do my nails. It's like a sponsored video for Lemon 8, the app. Love the app, it's so useful, so resourceful. Join me on my nail day as I do my nails for the spring season. This is the spring dry flower nails that I found on Lemon 8. But first, we need to do the Gel X base. This nail tech shared a very clever tip and hack for a seamless cuticle application. The artist did use acetone and a brush to blend the nail tip to the nail. I applied the dried flowers on top of the wet polished ombre and cured so the flowers can stay in place before sealing with top coat. I am so ready for spring. I love my new look. And we're at Miss K's salon. There's Miss K. She looks so cute. And wash your lashes coming to your left. Yeah, your lashes still look so good and healthy. The doll vibe. Mm -hmm. I think that like lifted my eyes. Yeah. Definitely not like as volume as we usually go. Yeah. I've been loving the lighter look. Okay. I'm we'll getting excited. I know. We've <laughs> never done anything less than a volume before. I'll see you guys back with lashes on. With lashes on. You guys see first. That appointment felt like 30 minutes. <laughs> really? Yeah. Here's what oh she looks like. Oh my god. They're perfect. Okay, is there anything you see that you would do a little bit differently? We did go a little bit shorter since we were in our natural era. No, I actually love this length. I think because they're lighter, they look longer to me. Yeah. Oh, I love what do we think? them. Dude, I'm obsessed. Thank you so much. Of course. Much. Thank you. They're so pretty. They're so like dainty and so cute. Mm -hmm. oh. This is people's like, oh my god, crazy. Yeah, you know? right. This is our dainty. <laughs> Why? Oh. You're always such a snitch. No, you move four back. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Look at my sassy sister behind the camera. Do editing her bits. <laughs> behind the camera. Haley. <laughs> yep, it's she's like musty. Haley! <laughs> Slayed by Kate behind the scenes. Oh. And this is Queen La Lindsay. Yes, sir. And then this is me. Oh, my neck. <laughs> It was at the park. You're so cool. Oh my god. The swing rashed my neck. morning loves it is a brand new day i woke up feeling just so refreshed and ready for the weekend and when you wake up tell yourself today is an amazing day not today will be an amazing day your consciousness doesn't know past or future it only purely lives in the present so if you tell it oh today will be a good day your consciousness is gonna it will feel like an endless kind of void because that day will never get here because it will like to your consciousness it's just gonna feel like oh my goodness like we're searching and searching and chasing and it's still not here so tell yourself today is a great day tell yourself i am a millionaire not i will be a millionaire i am a millionaire i am a nail type i am abundant i am valuable i am cherished i am loved i am loving and i love <laughs> Like they're definitely giving like spring, soft girl era, like okay. Yeah. 
This is the only way I take my vitamins. I'm gonna be honest, guys. Mine is yours. Is Lindsay sets them out for me because <laughs> she loves me. Do you have strong muscles? I'm gonna eat your vitamins. <laughs> <laughs> the wellness princess. Ah. You're so dramatic, bro. Say hi, Zay. Good morning. Hey, everybody, look at that uphill. <laughs> but this view, though. Let's go up there. Oh yeah. Me too. The best coffee ever. I always have So cute. Mm, this is so good. The fit? I just love getting waxed. I feel so like clean and just like put together. Guys, we're embodying the millionaire self. And my millionaire self always feels clean and put together about herself in all ways and you guys are the girls you guys know all the tmi i got this new exfoliate as well whatever makes the service even better as a client you have to put in your part so i have to continue exfoliating and it's us bro <laughs> oh my god bro look, look we have the bands right here my dream car right and there and then my fucking porsche guys in right the here back. and then you have 555 over there Oh my god. And then a Porsche Kaylee that has two girls in it. That's us right here, bro. And they're fucking hot. I love I shopping. Love Let's see. It turns nice, but like for business, everyday casual, like I love their jeans. I'm getting this really cute I set from HM. Thank you so much. Guys, tell her that she needs to dress more nicer. Look, this girl is on my head. Guys, that is so cute, actually. These are so gorgeous. They look so pretty. But then these ones match. Like my stuff. But the $10 difference. I'm gonna get one of the little pens. For class, I'm gonna be taking notes. Back secure. Thank you. Thank you, Yosef. Guys, like, please to tell this girl that she's beautiful because this dress is it's just cute. It's such a club dress, and you look good. Sure. And it's your hair vibe, like, it just goes with your hair. She got the dress, got the dress, the one I didn't want to try on. <laughs> no, I think I need an eight. They're pretty, though. They are. Yeah, they're perfect. I did. They're all dirty. Oh, no. <laughs> no way. That's a good job. Oh, Thank you. Like those look so good. Oh, Thank you. Oh my god. Like that was the first time. Well, in public like this, like shopping like yeah. that's so cool. Oh my god. She totally made my day. And her nose were so cute. Like <laughs> that's so crazy. Oh. <laughs> I could cry. Don't cry. <laughs> <laughs> She's just like the girl I strive to be like The woman Is that Slade my key? Oh my god I love you Thank you This one's yours We had to get some Dutch Just game time. Yeah. You ready? Yeah. Let's go, Patriots! Let's go! Let's go, Patriots! Let's go! Watch out, Patriots are coming! <laughs> Mira esas nalguitas. Mira, Lois, so precious. Nice. Right there, right there! Way to go, boys! Good Woo! Good morning, 
guys oh my goodness i'm getting ready to go skydiving it has been on the bucket list forever to go skydiving but this is like totally symbolic for me it's going to represent me jumping into the unknown and letting go of silly fears that are really just thoughts only fear fear itself you know because fear itself is what's gonna keep you stagnant and, and not progress putting myself in an uncomfortable an extremely uncomfortable situation which i'm all about is putting yourself in uncomfortable situations that trains your mindset to think okay if i can survive this uncomfortable situation then i can survive posting on social media then i can survive me being a beauty suite owner i can survive me being a celebrity nail tech if i can survive falling thousands of feet down i can survive anything <laughs> i actually used to be a very very fearful anxiety little girl like i would always ask like if everything's gonna be okay like is everybody gonna be safe am i gonna be safe like i was just a very scared little girl and i want to really break out of that because at the same time even though i was a very fearful little girl i was also such a brave little girl that endured and overcame so much me talking about my goals i'm asking myself like what am i afraid of like literally like what am i really afraid of to really like go after what i really really want and i sit and i sit and i sit and it's like i really can't find a logical answer so it's like that tells me i'm afraid of fear itself which tells me i have to challenge that and i have to change that because ain't no way i'm gonna sit and be stagnant and not accomplish my goals and my dreams just because little words flow into my brain like be so FF, be FFR. And I know it's so much easier said than done. Like we're really latching onto emotions and our emotions are super important and should not be overlooked. You know, cater to yourself, but also let them go. This is the outfit for skydiving. I will come back a brand new person, a person that has a skydive. Check in? No. Go check in, man. Let's get you guys manifested. Last but not least. No, not on that line. Okay. Thank you. I got a run, right? <laughs> How you feeling? I screwed this up. I got this. Yeah? How you feeling? Gang, gang. <laughs> How you feeling? Alex is a cute girl. Period. Super close on that. I'm on the way. 149. No more tacos. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I ate too much. Oh my god. There is. There is. Yeah. Oh, four yeah. Four minutes. Minutes. I just retired. How was it? I was like, are you going to get in? Yes. Here, structure, okay? Um, how are you feeling? Do you have anything in your pocket? Yeah. China! Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 China. Right. Yeah. 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 Turn on, baby. Some pressure on me. Oh. Am I right? Oh, yeah. It's like surreal now. <laughs> We're just living in a simulation anyway. Yeah. I love that. <laughs> oh, did you, did you hold that there for me? Could you like steal us a little bit more? I did. It's just for the leg straps and all. My god, you guys are not good at cameras. I just... <laughs> you guys have officially entered the middle. We're not together. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. The fam is going! 20 miles an hour. Let's go! Alright guys, everyone point up to that bright blue sky. Yo, product placement! Hey, hey. Oh, hi there. Woo! What's up, Kaylee? Yeah. I hear a lot of noise in the background. What's going on here? We're going skydiving. We're going to go skydiving today. Yes. How are you feeling about it? I'm excited. Good. That smile says it all. Yeah. Uh, anything you want to say before we get up into that sky? I'm going to come back a different woman. I love that. <laughs>
Such an amazing yeah. job. Oh Are you sure that was your first time? Oh uh, yeah. <laughs> no way. All right, big yeah. question. Would you do it again? Fuck yeah. Nice, yeah. welcome to Scott yeah. Phoenix. Awesome job, yeah. awesome job. Guys, you did great, Kaylee. Thank you. That was too much fun. That was a lot of fun. Yeah, girl. <sighs> welcome to Scott <Skydive> Phoenix. <sighs> Thank you. You're amazing. Thank you. Guys, we freaking did it. Oh my God, we're finally back home. Everybody's getting their rest because why does that actually take a toll of your body? Why does falling almost 10,000 feet up in the air take a toll on your body? The most amazing experience, the most coolest amazing thing I have ever done. If you're considering or even thinking of doing it, I 1,010% recommend it. We went to Phoenix skydiving and it was so good. It felt so like liberating but my favorite part was when the parachute went up and we were gliding and it literally felt like i was flying the fun day continues we are going to be going out tonight for my homegirl's birthday crusty toes i haven't got them i haven't got my toes done since the first week of the year and it's mid april no we have to do something about that from Zara. I actually fell totally in love with it. I'm wearing my new earrings that I actually got at the mall. And I have the blue jewelry. Let's go and have some fun. Oh guys, I just feel so like, so cute. So like, don't talk to me. Oh, I love you. Aww, so cute. So fucking cute. I want to lick you. Delivering babies right now. Wait, so, I'm like scared. It's kind of wild, yeah. 
Yeah, so put your first stone. Oh my god! How like, cute! Like, 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 right. Kaylee! Yeah. Kaylee! Yeah. 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 Like, I meant, like, one of the bears. I want to make sure you like it, though. Um, now we can exchange it. No, it's hard on my story. It's weird how it's happening. It's so pretty, dude. Oh, shit. Yeah. It's a boomerang, so do something. <laughs> That's so cute! No, don't apologize. <laughs> 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 Just slam water, exhale and slam water. Like, <laughs> it, I can't. That hurt my tummy. Lindsay, tell us how you feel about the skydiving. Oh my god, it was guys awesome. Just fucking like so fucking cool. I loved every bit of it and I just feel like a brand new fucking person. Okay. I just never felt more present in my life. Exactly. Like I didn't think about my past. I didn't think about my future. I literally thought about the now and like just yes. being there. I'm not even gonna lie to you guys. Like I even walked different yes last night really? knowing that, that hours ago I flew almost I dropped from almost 10,000 feet in the sky it's all about how you react to it in the now if you're falling off of the sky are you gonna freak out and not enjoy the beautifulness around you or are you gonna just fly and enjoy what it is because you know you're gonna land safely right. you know that these are trained professionals right. so it's the same with your dreams like if you know your dreams gonna come true enjoy the journey but you have to fully believe that your dream's gonna come true you have to believe that you're that I you like deserve that that, yeah. that you're worthy so of true. it and you have to walk like like you're already there you have to walk and you have to embody the person that you want to become usually when i vlog it's more like i'm talking to you guys but also to like my past off my feet my just me where it's like you really have to look at your life around you see it if you don't like it know that you're the creator of your life take accountability for allowing things like that for allowing people and give yourself compassion and grace that it's okay now you know you can never go back what should could have would have whatever now you know from here on out so it's like you can really create the dream life that you want any dream life that you want by being self-aware first with your thoughts you don't be mean to yourself be compassionate by yourself because your thoughts matter everything you see a person how they live that's a reflection of how they how they think to themselves and i know that at an early age doing nails because people will share to me their personal stories very deep personal stories and it's like it's really true your outer world really is a mere reflection of the way you think about yourself the way you talk about yourself it, if if you say oh i don't i don't deserve love and this person comes and treats you bad then of course you're gonna allow it because it's validating what you're already thinking about yourself i don't love myself and you're oh you can say you're loving yourself but saying is different than doing it than eating right than drinking your water than taking your vitamins even though you fucking hate to do them and i'm talking to me to like loving yourself is holding yourself accountability for the things that that you want to accomplish that's having compassion i usually i thought having compassion meant like Lindsay too like being too soft on yourself yeah being too soft on yourself when it's like having compassion for yourself means truly loving yourself to choosing what is right for you if you know that scrolling on social media is not right versus reading a book and you have the free time, then go read a book. Go walk for a mile. Do what's best for you. Yeah. The decisions. Am I going to lay in my ass and just scroll and just be sad about my life? Or am I going <laughs> to get She's up? She's Aries. Or am I going to get up and clean my face, brush my teeth, do my hair, go on a walk, you know, clean, you know, mm -hmm. cook some Hang real with good meals. Yeah. Quality read. loving time with family. You can't, you can't give out what you're not giving to yourself. You can't expect things back what you're not giving to yourself. You want you, you want good association? Are you being good association? Are you being are do you 
you want reliable people are you being reliable you want loving people are you being loving and it's and, a, but also but it's also not to be too harsh on yourself exactly. not to like, judge yourself because when you judge yourself then you judge those people that you talk to that exactly you see. everyone it's, around you you judge because you judge themselves exactly because you judge your yourself it's and i feel projection. like i learned that your thoughts are actually you're talking to your subconscious your mm-hmm. subconscious think of it as your little person self your little child like exactly. you as a little girl think of when you were five years old what and were that, you like, going everyone through everyone is just a kid deep down everyone inside. is just a child so everyone. just be nice everybody literally. like just be a good person just be nice literally you put good intentions out there the better opportunity and synchronicities exactly. are gonna come your way and you're not doing it because of those opportunities and synchronicities you just know that those opportunities exactly. and synchronicities are going to come because you deserve them it literally warms my heart anytime anybody tells me that i inspire them and it really really it, and it really makes me feel like but i'm just me you know i'm learning too like and i'm just so grateful and so glad that we can learn together that i'm able to literally document my 20s with you guys and achieving my higher self with you guys and knowing that my platform really is a place where i really belong and i can really do a good influence i'm not perfect by any means i have my doubt i have my flaws i have like i have myself doubts i have my fears and but it's like let's not let it define us and mm-hmm. that's why i'm so glad i'm able to attract even great people because i do believe this is our modern world this yeah. is this is like i do believe that technology is still energy you still you yeah. can feel the energy when you scroll through a video you can feel like oh that video did not make me feel good or oh this made me feel exactly. good and it's i just energy. want everything's energy and i want you guys to use your valuable time to watch my videos and be like you know what I feel like I can accomplish my dreams myself. I just want you guys to feel amazing about yourselves and know that like truly you can overcome anything if you really wanted to. You can really accomplish anything that you really want to and nothing is impossible. Like you think of it and it is a possibility. It really is. And why? And because, it's because you had that thought. Exactly. And it's exactly. a thought for a reason. And it like exactly. it knows that like sweetheart this is what you need to be doing. Exactly. That's you your know? inner voice that's your true self baby girl uh, baby cakes you just uncovered your 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 inner voice that true self Mm. purely knows that it is the creator of your life you literally come from source power you come from source energy no matter what you believe in it's if you're spiritual if you're religious everything and they say god to put a name so that way humans understand understand source energy source power the creative power and that's just a way for us to understand like it's not a big white why big man with, with like a beard no <laughs> yeah it's, it's just a, a energy a, a being energy. even <laughs> even in the bible it says oh, you are in you are created in the image of god exactly. what is god god is a creator god is source power you are so an extension are, of god so you are can. you are an extension of source power you hold that in your womb you yeah. hold that power in you of course you're gonna feel emotions of course you're gonna feel fear of course you're gonna feel doubts of course you're gonna have be hard on your be very uh, intuitive because you have that in you you carry the portal between source power vortex energy to human world hold that sacred hold that so sacred and tap into that power and know that you want that life you can create it and just to think that a year ago two years ago i was so different i in like more of a that bad place yes i was so mean to myself i hated myself and if that change can happen in me that i have no superpower i have nothing and just trying <laughs> to control my thoughts you can really do it and no matter what circumstances you're in you're more than your circumstances if anything your circumstances are what makes you 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 being a mother you being a single parent you, a college student you being a whatever a wife a mother a sister whatever it may you being living alone you being single whatever it may be that's meant for you to happen to really reach you where you're supposed to be and help those around you because when you really fulfill your your purpose in life you just want to spread that you want to give that love and maybe you're going through that to help people like you out and that's going to make you guys i could literally ramble forever but it's good it's good and i know that more growing will come out of this and i'm really proud of myself for the long ways that i've come but fuck i'm ready for the few i'm ready for what's coming i'm so ready for what's coming i'm so ready i'm so pumped up like 
I love you guys so much. Truly, truly, thank you from the bottom of my heart for watching my video. You guys have a beautiful rest of your spring season. Let this rebirthing energy, explosive, impulsive Aries flame get you going and clean out that closet. Get rid of those old belief systems. You know, not just literally clean out your physical environment, but clean out your mental journal. Let's guys, meditate tonight. Just like right now, take a bath. I feel like I could change my life right now. I feel like with this talk, I feel like. Like, bro, Lit. let me get up and let me go, like, <laughs> clean out my clothes. Like she said, because exactly. I need to just change, like, all of the bad things that I've and, and and it's not all the bad things. Not it's all bad. the old things. Old things. And that's all old it things. is. Old it's just old go. things. Yeah. And and that now it's time to recycle. That, yeah, that don't longer like help me to grow. Exactly. So the and things that don't help me to grow, that's the things that I gotta push out. With love. With love you know, yes. at one point this thing, this belief system hold, held me safe. At one point this thought held me safe. It made mm. me feel comfortable. I'm a I'm gonna give it its respect, I'm gonna give it its love, but I'm gonna let it go. It don't serve me no more. And just like yeah. that, you can do that with food in your life. You can do that with people in your life. Mm -hmm. Thank you for everything that you've given me. Thank you for this amazing time. But I continue my life. Exactly. But I can. I, but I. You. But I send you love because I want to continue this new journey and see and maybe and see and wonder maybe this is mm -hmm. for me because I have a feeling, mm -hmm. you know, and you guys know what feeling. Yeah. Where that, everybody knows that feeling. Yeah, that you want that. And you get that feeling you want that life because you're having it already. Mm -hmm. Anyways, I have, it's like that talk when moms are like, okay, bye. And then they keep talking yeah. and then bye. And then they keep talking. I could right. do that forever. I love you guys so much. Thank you guys for watching my video. I cannot wait to bring you guys along even more journeys and more experiences. Like, okay, wait, even I just want to say you're so fucking cool right now. Like, I'm seeing ah, you. Right stop. And no, no, like, no. Such a cool week. I hope you guys have a beautiful week. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell notification. So that way you guys can continue enjoying the journey. I love you.